All right, guys, welcome back. Right now we're gonna get into some of our literacy and we're gonna be introducing short and long. We've touched on it, but not as much as we would like to have been into the long uh, vowel sound. I introduced a song to you and it was some special letters have two sounds and vowel was their name. A, E, I, O, U, A, E, I, O, U, a, E, I, O, U, and that's a long sound. But there's another version. Some special letters have two sounds and vowel was their name, O. A, E, I, O, O, A, E, I, O, O, A, E, I, O, O, and short was their name. So they can make two sounds. There's a lot of rules to it. So we're just gonna say a few words and you're gonna tell me if you're hearing the letters name, or if you're hearing the letter short sound. If it's the name, it's long. If it's the sound that we've worked with since you were about this big, you're looking at your short vowel. So I'm gonna give you a word and it's goat. Go, O, O, O. Everybody hear the O sound? The O sound is right there. What if I said caught? Caught. You're hearing a short or long? You're hearing its sound that we originally learned? Ah, uh, caught. What about yellow? Yellow. You hear O or ah? Uh? You're hearing O. So that is a long vowel. Let's try another one. S snow. What are you hearing? Ah uh or O? Oh? You're right. You are in a long O vowel sound. How about hot? Ah, correct, you're in a short. What about toast? Toast, uh-huh. You're in a long vowel sound. You're hearing its name, not the original sound we learned. What about da ah, dog, P ah, pot? Those are both a short vowel sound. Just to practice a little bit more, I made up a couple more examples. This is our E, eh, and this is our E. E, eh, E. P N, men, pet, set, bell, desk. C, plain as day, you're hearing that E. Tree. Eat, sleep, we, green, eat, long vowel sounds. Now I'm gonna say a word and I want you to think this through and then yell it out if they, I'm saying a short vowel or if I'm saying a long vowel sound. It is the letter A or A, A or A. The first word is cat, cat. You're correct, you're hearing it in the short sound. What about jam, jam, another short. What about case, case? We're hearing A, it's a long vowel. Face, they, I hear A again. I'm in a long sound. What about, you know, this is a word I always tell you is much too strong for, for us to be using, but it is the word hate. Hey, a, a, up. Oh, it's definitely a long vowel. Male. May, a, 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 male. Now those are long. What about mat? Mat. We are in an a ah sound. Short. Hat. Sounds like it's in the at family and we know that that's a short vowel. Page, page, mm, correct, long. Nail, nay, -a nail. So we have our short vowels, our long vowels. Short says the sound, a, e, i, a, or a, uh, and long says a, e, i, o, and u. 
There's another way that we've been learning this, and we, it's with our family wheels. And so we have a rake, a snake, again, a long vowel, lake, a long vowel sound, cake, and a shake, not that kind of shake, the kind you eat. All right. So, but then we have this word family and it's the at. And we have bat, hat, cat, rat, and mat. And that's the ah sound. One more. We're looking at the e sound. Me, e, e, meat. Seat. Heat. Wheat, and back to meat. And then our short E sound, re uh, rest, vest, test, chest, nest. And maybe we can all take a rest. <laughs> All right, so that is your introduction into your short and long vowels. We will continue with this. You're going to be seeing some of this in your work packets that will be coming home. And I'll see you soon for story time.